let's see if we can focus. I've been so bad as usual uh, at recording videos. <laughs> I always think that I'm going to record a lot and then I have some videos to upload every week and I don't feel stressed about having to film but you know life gets in the way uh, yeah so yeah today we just have to do something and I thought I was going to do something with um, uh, from my treasure chest uh, I have bought a lot of stuff this weekend <laughs> from yeah Colourpop and Makeup Revolution I have bought a new Anastasia palette and I have bought some things from Violet Voss. Yeah. So in this month's months in this month's months haul there will be a lot more, but I don't think that everything will have gotten to me in time, get to me in time. Uh, so there will be for next month as well. And Gummal uh, and today we are going to do something with the Fenty Beauty Moroccan Spice. I love this palette. I have never used it, but I just... Ooh. And this was so expensive, so now it's time to use it. And it looks like this. Boop, 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 boop. Um, and I thought that I was going to do a two-toned look. So we can try out some looks. So I think I'm going to do one with... You know the browns maybe and one with the blue at least and the pink uh sorry i just realized that i didn't put on one of the primers that i was going to do very good like that i was supposed to do this before i was going out to do something today but you know it didn't happen uh, and then I had to do just one look because I was going somewhere and it looks weird if you have a two-tone look uh, or people think you are weird at least um, and I'm not that confident that I can rock a two-tone look like that um, but now I have already been to the place I was going to go to so yeah let's do it like that I just want to see See how this feels. Ooh. Ooh. Look. I just want to see what we have to work with here. Is that a white or just a shimmer? Oh, that was also a pink shimmer. Ooh. Ooh. Let's do something. Let's start with the first eye at least boop, boop, boop. Um, I'm just checking where Gumbal is at and I think that I'm going to take that shade in the crease let's try I never decide uh, beforehand what I'm going to do so it's always exciting to see what comes out of it that, well, it was light I was afraid that it was going to be a little bit darker sometimes it's darker than it is in the pan like that we only need a little and then, is that a green or a brown? It's a brown. I also love the grey. Hmm. Let's take the red. Gumal. Are you blown to skägget now? Ah. The first shade was very easy to blend out, I must say. And there is like almost no kick up and look what I just did <laughs> I put eyeshadow on my face how did I get eyeshadow all over the hand weird that's good that I am not on my face my gun was little <laughs> 
when Gunval drinks water, he gets um, water in the beard. <laughs> and now he's drying it on the carpet. Gunval. This was really nice. And there is no fall fallout. Fallout. I can't talk. There is no fallout so far. God, that was easy to work with. Hey? Hey? Konda? Hey! Hey! Is it a little bit video? Da. Du du får rätta till skägget där du. Där. Så. Duktig. I so sorry that I talk to Gumbal a lot in my videos, but you know he's around and he lives here, so it's weird if I don't. That should we take? Oh, now I want to use all the shades. Maybe we have to do two videos with this. There are different types of tones. You can see that brown almost looked like a gray, gray, green brown, but it's not. And that one is like a purple. And then you have like a pink red and more yellow red, like an orange. And then you have the gray. There is so much to choose from. What is that? Ooh, it's like a black purple. No, I don't want that everywhere. <sighs> what should we do? What should we do? Let's take the warm one. They blend very easy together. It just takes no effort at all. That I like. Let's see how the shimmers behave. Mm -hmm. mm. What shimmer should we take? Let's take that one. That messed up my face. Was that an overspray? Nope. Oops. Now I spray in my hand. Ooh, that's pretty. That's so pretty. It's almost green. I think I'm going to mix this with another shimmer. Let's take that one on top. I'm sorry that I'm bad at showing you what shades I'm using, but I just, I don't feel like it. <laughs> that one was a really good shade as well. When you look at this palette at first, when you open it up, it looks kind of boring. But then when you really take the time to look at the shades, they are really fun shades actually. Because when I open it, I think, oh, it's just a neutral palette with a pop of blue. But when you look at it, like I said, there is a pink and there is actually two blues and a gray. And the shimmers are really spectacular. Now I can see that I have some fallout because I can see it over here. That was really nice. Should we take more of that shade? Let's do it all! All shimmer! A little more of the red. Hmm. God, this was fast for being me. What should we do? Should we take that shade on the lower lash line as well? This was a really quick palette to use because you don't have to dip in a lot of times to get good pigmentation, but they blend really well. First impression, you know. I like it. Mm -hmm. 
Now I want, let's take that. That spreads a little shimmer in the palette, I can see. I think I'm done with this look on this side. That was quick. Well, it gets quick when it's easy to work with. Now we're going to do the other side. Boop, 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 boop. Glitter to be everywhere like that. What should we use as a transition shade? Because I think this one is a shimmer. Let's try the gray. Because I think it's light enough. Sorry, I don't have a lot to talk about because it's a Monday and on Mondays I always do one thing that I have not talked about with you and I will not do that for... I will do, I think, further in, but not now. Um, but I always go to a special place on Mondays <laughs> and I always... I'm so excited when I get home, usually, uh, and it's really hard to focus on something else than that thing. That gray didn't want to stick in the crease. Let's take another brush. I don't know why, but I really like gray. I don't understand why. Because it's not always it looks great when you put it on, but I just like them. Weird. Maybe I put on um, the primer very weird because the gray won't stick here in the crease. It don't matter really because I'm going to use another color, but it annoys me. <laughs> But it could also be the primer, so that I did not put it on properly. What is a shirt? And it in Fabi's. He's laying on top of the unicorn, you know, the big one that is as big as he is. Do a shirt. Now I would like to use the shimmer but I don't think it's dark enough so let's take let's take the purple brown a bit well I guess it's the primer because I can't get this color to stick either and that is usually not a problem I don't know if you can see it there Now I'm so impatient because I want to use the blue one. Let's use it with this one. Let's see how it works without Fix Plus. Ooh. Now I'm using a very small brush because I'm going to use another shimmer, but it worked fine. But I want to spray it anyway. <laughs> Ooh, that was pretty. I think I will have to use the other brush. Mm. Let's take that brush. I'm going to fix that sharp line so don't you worry Ooh, that is 
is such a pretty color. Okay, go with it. Hold on to the day. Uh, let's hope that was the neighbors. Can I take it to what it was? Let's take some of the pink. Ooh, that is so pretty. I have told you this before, but my neighbors are doing some, I don't know what they are doing. Or what is it called? Construction work? No. They they are below me and they moved in like like a year ago, I think. And they starting, you know, <laughs> doing a whole new apartment. And it's taken so long. And the other day they had the door open, so I just, you know, I could see inside the apartment. And it looks exactly like when they started. <sighs> that gives me no hope that they will be done soon. Why can't I get this pink to show up that well? Should I have done the cut crease? I'm just going to try to do it with my finger because it's so pretty. Oh, that worked. A little bit better. Let's do it like that. But it's not as pretty as it is in the pan, I think. We'll see. And I'm just going to try, because there is a shade that looks white, but when I swatched it, it looks like, you know, a pink topper shade. So I'm going to try to take that and let's see what happens. On top of the blue. Ooh, yeah, it's a topper shade. Mm, I like it. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Let's take some more of the blue. The mattes were a lot easier to work with than the shimmers. But the shimmers are, you know, some of the shimmers are very high shiny and just need a little spray. Let's take some of the dark blue. Ooh. What will happen if we will take that? There are two almost black shades. One is blue black and the other one is purple black. So I'm using the blue black right now. Let's see what we can make of that. Just make it a little bit darker. And then we'll take some of the gray. Are you? Like that. The pink doesn't show up like when you look in the mirror, but when you move your head around and the light hits it, it really looks pretty. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to take a little bit more of the red. Just fix the shape. I 
I think I'm going to take some of the yellow shadow actually on top of that pink. I'm going to take wavelength. This is from Colourpop. Ooh. So it looks like that. Just want a bit. I think that's too much. Oh. Okay. oh, I got too much. Take it off. Is that that? Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, I got too much. Spread it out before it dries. Spread it out. Oh, it's so pretty. God, that's pretty. I've taken it a bit on my hand to take a little bit of time. God, that's so pretty. I love this. Could have taken the other shade as well, because it's blue, but should we take that on top? Yeah, but I really like the way it looks right now. It's just that I want to try it. <laughs> looks like that. This is Hallucinogenius. I don't know. Let's take a bit. And that did not work. Ooh. Ooh. It's so hard. Oh no. God, that's a lot. Spread it out. God, that's so pretty. <laughs> it really enhanced the blue a lot, even though this is more purple. God, that's pretty. Sorry, but God damn it. <laughs> it I thought it was going to be more purple when I took it on because it looks really purple down here but really uh, enhance the blue and it doesn't look purple at all <gasps> god i love this if you have not tried the yellow shadows i really recommend them especially if you like you know like liquid shadows because these are so nice to apply and they really stay put now i see if i can take this off before it's drying ah i'm glittery okay i'm, I'm going to be glittery but yeah now i'm going to fix uh, the rest of my face and um, i'm going to be back and show you more in depth what I used so bye for like 10 minutes for me but one second for you now I'm back and I already know that I failed when I put on my lipstick but I'm not uh, very uh, I was not very careful because I'm going to take it off right off when I have filmed this video and no matter what I do right now I'm only making it worse <laughs> so ignore that uh, but I must say that I'm pretty pleased with both looks. Um, that look is more me. <laughs> but uh, I'm, I also must say that I really liked this look before I put on the yellow shadows. 
but the yellow shadows really made that look pop because the pink one really helped the pink shadow to show up and the blue purple one really made the blue look a little bit better so i'm really pleased see if i can show you but here's that look oh, i don't know if you can see uh but i'm really pleased it never shows up it's like i'm doing something weird with my eye but it turned out really blue but yeah you get the uh and i used for that eye i used um uh, let's see if i have something to point with let's take this i used that shade in the crease and then the red shade and then that shade and I used that shade on the lid and also that shade the shimmery shade but that's more a colorful shimmer the other one is more like a topper I think and on the other eye I used the gray as a transition shade and then I used uh, a little bit of that purpley brown shade and then I used that blue and that pink and I took that on top of the blue as well and then I also took a little bit of that blue in the inner corner so yeah I used one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven shades and there are 16 so that's good <laughs> and i'm really pleased and i also use these two yellow shadows from colourpop in wavelength the pink one and hallucinogenous i don't know uh, and it's like a blue purple it looks more purple when you take it out on the hand but it really turned out blue on the eye because i had blue under it so yeah i'm pleased and now i'm going to take the lipstick off look but uh, i really want to try the lipstick and all the other things on my face are from uh, my treasure chest and my project pan so i have the <laughs> I took a little too much bronzer over here as you can see but you know ignore that but that's the butter bronzer from Physicians Formula and I used uh, the highlighter is from Urban Decay it's their afterglow highlighter in Aura you know the pink one and as blush I used the balm in stain in pinstripe it's you know the purpley shade it's really pretty though but you have to be light-handed but yeah, I think that was all for this video. <laughs> Bye!